probability of combined events. The SSM mathematics form 4. Mutually exclusive events and non-mutually exclusive events. Self-practice 9.3c, page 261. Number 1. Seven cards labeled with the letters G, E, M, B, I, R, A are put in a box. A card is chosen at random from the box. By listing all the possible outcomes, calculate the probability that the card chosen is labeled with a vowel or a letter R. The vowels in the letters are E, I, and A. There is only one letter R. Or means we combine both of them. So the probability is 4 per 7. 7 means there are 7 letters. 4 means there are 4 possible outcomes. Number 2. Two boxes labeled as K and L contain 4 cards labeled with the letters S, E, R, I and 3 cards labeled with the numbers 4, 5, 6 respectively. A card is chosen at random from each box. By listing all the possible outcomes, calculate the probability of getting a letter S from box K or a multiple of 3 from box L. So, a card is chosen from box K and then another card is chosen from box L. So, the two cards that are chosen may be S4, S5, S6, E4, E5, E6, R4, R5, R6, R4, I4, I5 or I6. If a letter S is chosen from box K, then the two cards that are chosen may be S4, S5 or S6. If a multiple of 3 is chosen from box L, then the two cards that are chosen may be S6, E6, R6 or I6. Oh, so we combine all of them, the repeating elements write only one time. So there are 6 elements and 3 times 4 means the total possible outcomes. So the probability is 1 per 2. Number 3. The probability of appointing Jesse as the chairman of the finance club J and the head of the spot house K, R, 3, R, 8, and 2, R, 9, respectively. A. Complete the Venn diagram on the right to represent the relationship between the probability of appointing JC as the chairman of the finance club and the head of the spot house. The probabilities of appointing JC as the chairman of the finance club and the head of the spot house can be written as P, J, intersect K equals E J multiplied by B K. J intersect K mean this area. So P J intersect K is three over eight times two over nine, and gets one over twelve. The probability of pointing J C as the chairman of the finance club is three over eight. So the probability of appointing JC as the chairman of finance club only in this part is 3 over 8 minus 1 over 12 equals 7 per 24. The probability of appointing JC as the head of the spot house are 2 over 9 mean this part 2 over 9. So the probability of appointing JC as the head of the spot house only mean this part is 2 over 9 minus 1 over 12 equals 5 per 36. The probability of not appointing JC as the chairman of the finance club or the head of the spot house can be written as P, the complement of J union K. Or means union, not means complement. We need to remember that the probability of event A plus the probabilities of the complements of event A is always 1. So the probability of complements of event A is 1 minus the probability of event A. 
So the probabilities of the complements of J union K is 1 minus the probabilities of J union K. The probability of J union K means 7 over 24 plus 1 over 12 plus 5 over 36. So we need to minus all three probability. And we get 35 per 72. Number 4. The Geography Club of SMK Tiradik organized a study group tour to Kota Kinabalu. The probability of Mendy and Gita joining this tour are 4 over 7 and 9 over 14, respectively. Complete the following three diagram. Hence, calculate the probability of either Mendy or Gita joining this tour. The probability of Mandy joining this tour is 4 per 7. And the probability of Mandy not joining this tour is 1 minus 4 over 7. So we get 3 over 7. The probability of Gita joining this tour is 9 over 14. And the probability of Gita not joining this tour is 1 minus 9 over 14 so it's 5 per 14 outcome first one m g second one m complement g third one complement of m and g and the last one complement of m and complement of g either mandy int m and complement of g either eta int complement of m and g or so we need to find the sum of these two probabilities so the probability of m and complement of g is 4 over 7 multiplied by 5 over 14 and we get 10 over 49 the probability of complement of M and G is 3 over 7 multiplied by 9 over 14 and we get 27 per 98. Then we find the sum of these two probabilities and we get 47 over 98.